Hey everyone, welcome back to Sydney Sisters. So today is the first day of December, so the first day of our Vlogmas, of our five day Vlogmas, five day intervals. So um, right now we are decorating the tree, so Heather's still gonna decorate it and yeah, um, so we'll have the time in the back <laughs> And then now we're gonna put an advent calendar together. So we're doing a Hague's chocolate one. So it comes with like the advent calendar thing and then also the um, chocolates which came in this. So I'm gonna put this together. Girl, I'm looking at a face I don't recognize today myself. Don't know what to say, things ain't the same I felt. That we lost a way, the street is two ways and God. So I have filled the advent calendar. So this is the first day. And we got some milk chocolate. And everybody keeping to themselves. I know you're sorry. You dragged me through hell. If this was real, can you tell me what you felt? Cause it feels like it's over now. There's just too much pressure. Hi everyone. So it is day two of Vlogmas and Right now it's actually 3.50, so it's kind of the afternoon. I've had quite a busy day, but nothing that I can really film, I guess. But this morning I went to the shops with my mum and we went Christmas Christmas shopping for bedroom decor. So I'll show you guys that a bit later. And then after that, I also went to the gym and did a yoga class, which was really nice. So now I'm back home. And before I go to golf practice um, this afternoon, I'm going to tidy up my room a bit. Just got like a lot of laundry that I have to put away and stuff. Sorry, I didn't film a lot yesterday. I just wasn't really feeling that well. And yeah, I didn't really feel well yesterday or the day before, but I feel a lot better now. Also, when I went Christmas shopping today, I went to Kmart and my main goal was like to get my Christmas tree for my bedroom, which I really want this year. But unfortunately, Christmas trees have like been sold out everywhere for like the cheaper sort of stores like Kmart and Target. But I still got like decorations and the baubles and everything like that. So once I do get the tree, I can decorate it completely. But I, I finished school on Monday, so it's Wednesday today, and I finished on Monday. Um, but Heather's still going, she doesn't finish till next Wednesday. On the weekend, I'm actually going away for a golf competition. Um, so I'm a bit nervous about that, but excited because I haven't played in a golf competition since like mid last year, I think was the last time I played. So it's been like a year and a half since I played in a competition. So yeah, I'm a little nervous, but I think I'll be fine. I think that was all that I had to say. So I'll quickly do a little haul for you guys of what I got from Kmart and then I'll tidy up my bedroom. So it's not gonna be a huge haul, but I did get a few things. These are the baubles that I got. It's a pack of 100 for like $15. And then I got this for the star on top of the tree and it actually lights up as well, which is pretty cool. I also got um, some, some multicolored string lights and then as well as just some white string lights. So I feel like those two on the tree will look really good. The last thing I got was this Santa um, snow globe. So it's so cool. Yeah. <laughs> so that is all I got. So it's not like a lot, but I'm just excited to have some things. As well as I have my red blanket. So a huge throw blanket. So that I'm going to put on my bed. I'm just excited for Christmas. <laughs> yeah, my room's a mess. I have a whole bunch of laundry to do. You can kind of see. But school has officially finished for me. So I'm kind of like going to organize a lot of stuff. So I'm going to tidy up my room and I'll put you guys on the timeline. So today is the third day of Vlogmas and it is 8.48 and I woke up a few hours ago actually but 
just starting to get into the day i guess yeah so today i'm going to have a productive day i'm going to tidy my room and everything because it's still quite messy and yesterday i didn't finish my arm today is really sore i don't know what's wrong with it but it just feels like I've got like a shot or something. And kind of like that heaviness sort of feeling. And yeah, it's really weird. I don't know what to do about it. But I've got a golf competition. Not tomorrow, but the day after. Okay, so let's go. I go start the coffee. Sunday morning, easy love. Will you? Okay, okay, okay. I'm your sunshine. The camera cut off for some reason, but here's the finished bed. <laughs> Um, but yeah, now I've got to put all of this stuff away. Girl, I'm looking at a face I don't recognize today myself. Don't know what to say, things ain't the same I felt. That we lost away, the street is two ways, and girl. I found these when I was Christmas shopping. I found these at a dollar store like a few weeks ago. And they're like taper candles, which are like the long candlesticks. And I'm going to do that um, DIY that I've seen all over TikTok where you like bend the candles. So I'm not sure when I'm going to do that. Also, I went to Vinnie's and I got some glass jars because I'm also going to do that other DIY where you like paint the glass jars. Um, to make them look like they were made out of like clay or whatever. Okay guys, so I just finished working out and it's now 11.45. And I wasn't working out for the whole time because I was watching a bit of Friends. Now I'm going to organise probably the messiest thing in my room i'm mostly clean and organized when it comes to my room for like drawers and stuff but i do have one like cupboard section that is a bit messy um it's kind of like my craft section so today i'm going to go through it and i'm going to like glue stuff in and stuff to my art journal i'll quickly show you guys my art journal i haven't done an in-depth video of it but i might do one one day but yeah it's got all this stuff on here that I did and then this sort of like dream capsule looking thing and then this really cool ribbon to keep it all together it's super thick and the only things I'll quickly open it and show you guys I haven't written in it maybe only the first page I have this is the front cover and then inside I've just got pages full of like lollies and stuff and um like tags if I bought stuff but so far I haven't written anything in it except for like the first page. Probably won't till I glue everything in and then I'll be like writing stuff in it. But yeah, so I just wanted to quickly show you guys that. So a lot of like stuff down there is stuff that I can glue into here like this, like what I did here or like taped in. So that's what I'm going to do today. <laughs> Hi guys, so I saw I talked to you about getting set up. But so today, um, I'm not sure if Josie sort of ooh, said it or not. But I'm currently having the day off today because I am like a little bit sick. Because like over the weekend, it's a bit weird. I've had like a bit of like, si well not sinus pain, but sort of felt like that. Like pain in my like head and jaw and then a bit achy and then a bit hot too and then recently over the weekend I actually was going to vlog it but it was just way too hot so I didn't end up doing it but it was like 40 degree days for like both of the weekends and then even today's like gone up to 27 degrees so 
get consistently hot days and we've only got a pool which is good thank goodness and then only one room with aircon but even that wasn't really working so i think josie and i both got a little bit of heat stroke today i'm still hanging the day off because of that just to rest for my music exam tomorrow but also to, to like practice a bit more so i think now i'm just going to play sonnet time first i've actually been using this app called any tune pro and um i did have the free version but i recently got the um, paid version because yeah you can kind of save a bit more pieces and stuff so that's sort of kind of what I've been using so I've sort of been um yes it sort of looks like that so I've just sort of been saving the backing tracks and sort of slowing it down yeah guys so I'll talk to you a little bit later and yes yeah, so I'm just going to keep practicing so I'm just going to do sonotime time for a while and then do my scales and then yeah I'll talk to you after I do those um sorry all the time that i film my hair is always weird but um yeah that's just life gosh because i feel like since like it's been summer well pre-summer gosh my hair's just been all over the shop even more than it has in winter so sorry if it's a bit weird looking but yeah so it's currently i think 20 to 6 i'll flip you guys around and show you what i've sort of been doing just to like sort of remember my scales so for the first stage i actually have just been playing through my pieces so i'll just quickly show you the pieces i'm playing so i'm playing sonatine then this is my study piece cola they're probably tied in sort of difficulty level and sort of how i'm going with it so hopefully on the day and then a Dante and C is probably my best one and then these are the scales I have to do so I have to do a B set so B um B major and then the B minor so melodic and harmonic and then the arpeggio for the major and the minor then I have to do D major um and then the D minors and then I have to do F sharp major and the F sharp minors and then I have to do pentatonic scale starting on F sharp chromatic scale starting on B diminished seventh on b flat dominant seventh on in the key of b this notebook i sort of wrote all the scales i had to do and i sort of wrote a bit of a to-do list and then i sort of highlighted the ones that i've already known and what i've sort of played so with the arpeggios i probably could have just highlighted them but then with these ones are the ones that i had to learn so now i've actually sort of without my instrument for example so i go to okay so i might do b flat major and then i sort of remember the key signature and see if there's try and remember if there's any accidentals and then if there's an arpeggio for it then I do the arpeggio and then with the arpeggio sort of ones oh and then for the pentatonic I sort of try to remember so it's an F sharp key signature so F major um key signature it skips the B so then what I've been doing too is actually going on my iPad just watching like a few minutes of a YouTube video then just pausing it at a random point and then sort of remembering okay maybe do um D minor melodic or something and then I'll try and like recite what it is so that's sort of like rope learning I guess and sort of just trying to memorize it so that's what I sort of recommend you doing for your scales but on I would actually show you my bullet journal so this is my bullet journal if you guys don't know so this is my spread and it's sort of a bit like unusual because normally I don't really like sort of do scrapbooky sort of stuff but I thought like why not because um, I'm actually copying Amanda Rachley's one but sort of like of course it won't be exactly the same here is the first one and with this I haven't finished yet but Josie just had a good idea just to like outline it in black and just sort of keep it so on here I've actually used baking paper because I couldn't find um like brown sort of like normal paper because it's actually cardboard so um, this is a quote from a Smith for Jade song. And then I've done like a little bit of paper and a bit of washi tape. So you sort of see that in there. And yeah, as I said before, I haven't completely finished, but it's basically what it'll be looking like. And then I've sort of done that and I'll be writing December in there. But this is my sort of calendar spread. And then this is my December trackers. So I've got flute, reading, workout, foam roll, driving, golf, stretch. And then I sort of like colour in and half. So wake up before 7.30, go to bed before 10.30pm. And then this month, instead of doing like the normal sort of 
um, like picture ones that are so colored in. I'm actually going to do like a bit of a graph, which Amanda is, and I have never done this before, so hopefully it sort of works out well. And then lastly, this is my weekly spread. Sadly, I haven't really filled it out much, but um, yeah, so this is like my to-do list, so my main one, YouTube. I really like this one. That's probably my favorite. And then this one, and then school to-do list. And I'll quickly show you guys my November spreads because I actually really like this. So, so basically this spread is dedicated to my grandma that passed um, late November. So we have this, so I speak to the stars, you shine in my heart, you're never far when we're apart. So this is from A Smith for Jade, um, song nine, because this album was dedicated to a mum that passed away of cancer. Throughout, I've done like a roses theme. So this theme is sort of like a garden theme because my grandma was really loved her garden and so gardening in general so yeah and then a little november spread goals so you can sort of see that didn't really do those <laughs> this is my mood tracker and, and then write something so basically like a gratitude sort of thing slash diary and then my habit tracker and as you can see yeah sort of a bit back yeah bit of a hot mess with <laughs> all of that and then this is sort of like a weekly spread weekly spread i really like that like adding the flowers and then with this one, I actually really like so doing the week and the doing to-do list on the separate one. And then I actually really like this. I really love the color scheme of last month's one. I sort of really loved using purple, green, and sort of gray together. So hopefully you guys enjoyed my bullet journal spreads. Morning guys, I won't really do a close up shot because I definitely have like a fresh morning face. Today's currently Sunday. My mum, she's currently walking Coco, our uh, dog. And also too guys, sorry, you're probably like Coco, like who's that? So we recently got a um, new dog. Our first dog since like Josie and I were probably like four and like two or whatever. So um, yeah, we recently got her on, well not recently now, it's been a couple of months on the 31st of October, so Halloween, so that'll always be easy to remember. Today the plan is, because my mum's currently walking Coco, as I said before, then we're actually going to this shop that's like a bit of like a bougie, like decor store, and also has a bit of a cafe, so we're gonna go there and get like a few Christmas um, decorations, if it's not too expensive, and then maybe get a bit of a Christmas candle. Oh yeah guys, also too, before I go and start getting ready, I thought I'd quickly show you the Christmas decorations. Um, so yeah, we put a bit of like tinsel there and um, there's like a little Santa in the garden there. So then we actually got these lights from Kmart and with all of this, we might do like a, we might do it properly a bit later once the house is a bit tidy, but do like a bit of a decoration sort of thing. And then Princess sitting there. Good girl. Gosh, my voice always breaks when I talk to her. Um, but yeah, so Christmas lights. And then we got this uh, bed, bath and table, this little nutcracker and it lights up on his like little theme of Bob's there. So that's quite cute. Then this is a photo from, I think maybe quite a few years ago. I might have been still in junior school maybe, but yeah, this nice Santa photo. And then this is such a cute frame. The little snowman and yeah, so cute. And then a little Santa. This Santa we've had for years. I'm actually not sure where my parents got this, but I might have even got it before I was born. And then that, that. Bit of tinsel there. Got some lights here. Then our Christmas tree. We've got a few lights out there too. And then, oh yeah, then we've got our advent calendar. And then here where we put our school bags, that's like a paper sander. I made it you too. It's funny, I still sort of remember making it. And then just Santa hats, that. Then on there, we've got like a few reindeer. And yeah, so that's sort of all the Christmas decorations. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below if you want to see more Vlogmas videos. And we'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!